welcome back to another Stop Wrestling Part 2. My name is Beautiful Dave Easton. Let's get things going. And Paul Heyman is in the ring. Why is Paul Heyman here on Raw? Let's find out. Yes, well, we've just said, Paul, we want to find out why are you here? And he's saying he's got a, he's got a new client. Well, there you go. Who is this? He says, now I'll tell you all people who he is next week. And, we'll, and we will be someone you will never, ever forget again. Very strange. I wonder who that is, Paul. Well, there you go. Quick word from Paul Heyman, but let's move on. Next match is a tag team contest. It's the Kings of Wrestling taking on the team of Zadlan and Giant Limbo. And here is Kings of Wrestling, Antonio Cesaro and Cassius Ono. And as they've come over to Raw, really needed to um, step up. Uh, Cassius has been telling me, he says, they've had a little bit of success, but they want the tag team gold. And it's now time to challenge Money Club after last after they won la uh, 48 hours ago at SummerSlam. And well, when these two men are on their game, I don't think there is a better tag team here in non-stop wrestling. But let's find out now. They have a difficult opponent tonight. And I'm sure this, this ta next team will test them to their limits here in non-stop wrestling. As it is, well, one half of their opponents, it is the big man, Zadlan. Big individual, big acquisition for Raw. Well, this. well what, what can you say about this man? Just look at the just build of him, really. Just very, very daunting figure. I'm sure it could be, along with his tag team partner, a very, very uh, good test for the Kings of Wrestling tonight. Don't get many words with Zadlan. Not a, one of many words. Just likes his, likes to do his actions in the ring. In tag team action tonight. And his tag team partner. Not another another man to be messed with here in non-stop wrestling. It is Giant Limbo. So really, Kings of Wrestling going to have a bit of a task on the hands of two. The, the big men here in on the Raw brand. Giant Limbo. Not really one. We can see, you see backstage. We tried to get words with him. Again, not a man of very many words. Could be that he also speaks Russian as well. Not a very good um, thing to get much out of him. But... We, when we have seen him in the ring, he has been very destructive. That is your next match here on Raw this evening. It is Kings Wrestling versus Sadlan and Giant Limbo. And Cesaro, not scared to trade punches with Sadlan. Don't know what how effective that will be in the long run. But quick tag out. Cash is on it. Are we going to see the move? Yes, it is. Drop to hold in to the elbow drop. Used by so many teams here in non-stop wrestling. And look at this, Cassius Ono throwing Zadlan over the top, but Zadlan holds on, then his kick to the floor. Again, I hope they don't come for this announce table. We've just put it back together for the second time already today. Cassius Ono throwing Zadlan back into the ring, but Giant Limbo on the outside. You've got to be careful of him. There it is. Doing the dirty work for Zadlan, throwing him back in. Zadlan now into the armbar. Looking for a quick submission, doesn't get it. Remember our main event tonight, Edge versus Daniel Cage. It is for the world title. It is the rematch. Daniel Cage won his rematch tonight. And John Laurinaitis, our GM, has given that opportunity. Such a good match they had at SummerSlam as well. Sadlan in control of this one. Really, we'll see whoever wins this match could be, really could be in line for a tag team title shot somewhere down the road and look at that the power of Zadlan and Giant Limbo Limbo here on the outside oh no they come on leave the announce table alone we've just put it back together again 
What is it with these and announce tables tonight? Cash is on her though. Look at this. Drops. Limbo down with the front DDT and then with obviously with Zadlan out there. Got to be careful. Always it'll be the two on one. Oh no, doing the best thing here. Oh, went to tag and Cash is on her, walked across. I think a bit of miscommunication there. Look at this. Oh, drops the arm down. But Ono manages to recover. Needs to get a tag, I think. Oh, Limbo now they go behind another headlock. And he drops the arm down. Sort of matching move for move here. Limbo now tagging in. Zadlan, what is this? Ono in the wrong part of town. Oh, he is now. Big clothesline out of the corner. Desperately needs to get Antonio Cesaro into this match. Sadland though continuing the pressure. Really, the same money club who've just arrived, we've seen before the break. You have to think they'll be watching this match as Cassiano allowed to tag in Antonio Cesaro. Sadland to the outside here. I don't know what the, his plan is. Maybe it is to beat Cesaro in. Look at this, just throws Sadland. What is this? Cesaro takes the big man through the barriers. Oh my goodness. What a collision that is. And the big man is struggling here. As all four men are now on the outside. And Zadlan thrown into the steel steps. And well, they continue fighting on the outside. Cesaro taunts on the inside the ring and Cassius is doing a work here on Zadlan three times into the steel steps referee still counting letting this go a fourth time into the step Zadlan's going to be counted out here if he's not careful Cassius Ono was tripped and he has kings of wrestling have won by count out and really Jan Limbo and Zadlan were more interested on the outside and kings of wrestling have picked up the win here in our third match on Raw. And really, has that warranted a title shot for Kings of Wrestling? Cassius Ono did a right number on Zadlan on the outside, but then I think if out the picture that uh, Zadlan tripped Cassius Ono up, tried to get back in the ring and was counted out. And Kings of Wrestling have picked up a massive victory here. Zadlan really took a beating on the outside, Jan Limbo should have really tried to get him back inside but a big win tonight for the Kings of Wrestling over really the biggest tag team we have here in size wise in Limbo and, and Zadlan big win, Kings of Wrestling tonight here on Raw as we're here, and here on Money Club it's been guessed at this time it is the first ever tag team champions and oh, it is going to be Jay Masters versus Jimmy Uso tonight Tibiossi. Well, that could be true. The other, the, other um, the most powerful team if they have the tag team belts. And Tibiossi saying Jay is going to prove it tonight in singles action. Well, does money mean power? Uh, well, you would think it does after you see who's winning the ta uh, who's got the tag team belts. And well, Jay Uso, sorry, Jay Masters versus Jimmy Uso is coming up a little bit later on. So there you go. Thank you, for Michael Cole, for that. Coming up now, it is the United States Fatal Four Way Number One Contendership match: Sean Bethwick, Christian, Curtis Barnett, and the Fallen. And here is Christian. Captain Charisma is here, and he has got a chance at becoming the number one contender in the United States title tonight. Nice to have Christian here on roll here in non-stop wrestling. Arrived a couple of weeks ago. And well, let's hope for it. For his peep's sake that he can get to be the number one contender tonight. Such a decorated career for this man. Multiple tag team champions in other organisations as well as world champions in other organisations. Let's hope he can reach them heights here. 
in non-stop wrestling. Tonight, though, big chance to become the number one contender to Biggie Langston's United States title if he can pull off the win in this fatal four-way. But he will be going against one man that he's already faced here in non stop on a couple of occasions. And that is Sean Bethwick. But this is Curtis Barnett. And many people still buzzing about what the relationship with him and Megan is. But for now, he will be concentrating on this fatal four-way. And Curtis, again, another newcomer into non-stop wrestling the last few weeks. Made a bit of an impact. And what a more of an impact to make if he can become the number one contender. And I'm sure Megan backstage will be watching this with interest. But Curtis, big night for him. Big fan favourite here in non-stop wrestling. Fans really have taken him, I think, especially with what happened earlier on when he helped out Megan. Well, let's see. But here is the show. Sean Betherick, Mr. Twitter. As he likes to always say, the most Twitter followers here in non-stop wrestling. Well, you can uh, see Sean the show at Twitter. Follow him. Well, the first ever non-stop wrestling champion. He will always have that to his name here. As he claimed the title in the ladder match. Back at Unforgiven. But tonight, he will be aiming to become the number one contender of the, the United States title. Next in line for a shot at Big E Langston. Let's see if he can do it. Let's see, he's already had it. He's running with Christian and Curtis Barnett. But this man is surely, you would have to say, the favourite. The fallen from the Wyatt family. Former hardcore champion. Now looking for more singles gold. And I'm sure he's had a word in his ear from Gray Wyatt knows exactly what he has to do tonight. Big, big opportunity for the Fallen. And these are your four men, ladies and gentlemen, who will be in this match. And surely, as you say, this man got to be classed as long as one of the favourites, just for the sheer power. Really scariness of this man. Here we go then. Fatal four way number one contendership for the United States Championship on the line to face Biggie e. Langston. It's the first pin to get a pinfall or submission. And I think Christian's doing the right thing going after the bigger man early on. And Curtis and Sean Bethwick going at it at the other side. Look at this from Christian. Oh, big back spinning elbow. Take him falling off his feet. And then the swinging neck break. At Christian really doing a number on the fall early on. And Sean Bethwick plants Curtis Bonnet on the other side. Got to watch out for the sneakiness, really, of Sean Bethwick. He's done it a couple of times. Where he's still stolen a win. And Christian, oh, come on, Christian, leave us this alone. What is it with you going after the announce tables tonight? Bethwick inside the ring. Going for an, a quick cover on Curtis Bonnet. Gets only a one. What is it with these and these going after our announce tables tonight? Don't understand. Christian's right here in front of us. Where's he going now? What is Christian doing? The elbow drop. Oh, through the announce table. Again, our announce table taking it. But inside the ring, Sean only getting a one. Thought he was stealing one. But look at this. Curtis coming back. Drop kick and another, and then the big swing and neck breaker takes down Sean Bethwick. Christian now on the receiving end by the falling Curtis Bonnet into the cover, hooks the leg, only gets a one. 
so much going on. Curtis now on the goal behind. Picks up and drops. Sean Bassett down on his head. Outside the ring, falling in. Chris Christian still going at it. Drops the knee down, Christian. Curtis trying to set Sean Bethwick up here. But I think it's took it. Curtis has had a few two shots and he's feeling the effects letting Sean ba back in. Bethwick inside the ring, big snap, suplex, takes over. Curtis into the cover, hooks the leg inside the ring. Gets only a one on the outside. The Fallen has taken Christian down. And is in command. Look at this. Just picking Christian up by the arm and then dropping him down inside the ring. Curtis has got a cover on Sean. Bathwick gets only a one. Didn't hook the leg. But all these covers and kicking out is really going to take the effect. And a DDT by Curtis. Is that a no? Can he get the cover? He, no, he's going to set him up. Falling through and Christian back inside the ring. Into the head, says as inside the ring, and then a big shot across the head of Sean Betherick. Christian now, what? Oh no, sorry, it's fallen. What's this? A pile driver to Christian. Oh my goodness, that could be the end right there. Into the cover, doesn't hook the leg, gets a one, only a one. Betherick still concentrating on it. Chris Bonnet is a big sit out power bomb by the fallen. Into the cover, could that be enough? To put Christian away, it is. And out of that, Sean Bethwick wasn't watching. And the Fallen is your new number one contender for the United States Championship. He will face Biggie Langston. And what Bray Wyatt will have to be impressed with the Fallen tonight. And this was the beginning of the end for Christian. Big pile driver. Then the sit out power bomb. Look at the strength of the, of the Fallen when he does that. And then gets the three. Sean Bethwick was still concentrating on Curtis Barnett. And the Fallen. Well, trouble coming Biggie Langston's way. As one member of the Wyatt family. Well, if you know if one member is coming after you, it'll be the old three of them. And the Fallen is your winner. Be interesting to see when. If Bray Wyatt has anything to say later on, he's coming up in action a little bit later on as well. Your winner and new number one contender for the United States Championship, The Fallen. And that is the end of Non-Stop Wrestling Raw Part 2. Please like, subscribe, tell us what you think. Stay for Part 3. Beautiful TV Stins signing out.